ago. So how will New York State try to stop the spread of COVID-19 in the coming months? And what role will incoming Governor Kathy Hochul play in that process? News 12's Kevin VC asking those questions today. He joins us live tonight outside of the hospital in Valley Stream. Kevin. And Macy, those questions are really important because right now we're in the middle of yet another COVID spike. In fact, officials here at Northwell Health tell me their coronavirus hospitalizations have more than doubled in just the last few weeks. So now some are saying they want clear guidance from the state to help slow the spread. There's a lot of confusion as to when I should wear the mask, when I should not wear the mask. Sedgwick Easley is a Hempstead pastor who worked closely with Governor Cuomo as part of his coronavirus task force. But with Cuomo on the way out, there's currently no state guidance when it comes to indoor masking or schools. Easley is hoping the next governor, Kathy Hochul, can change that. I hope that she puts a, that she's stern. I really hope that she puts a mask mandate out, and I really hope that she gives us precise orders and directions of how to move forward. Today, Hochul was mostly tight-lipped about her plans to fight the pandemic, refusing to commit to indoor masking rules. Instead, she emphasized the importance of vaccination. More people being vaccinated is our key out of this. And I'm going to be working with the communities where the rates are higher, the infection and the vaccination rates are lower. But the fact is, COVID cases are spiking right now. Dr. David Badnelli with Northwell Health says everyone should be cautious, even without mandates in place. Anybody who does want to contribute to getting rid of this virus and keeping everybody safe must wear a mask. And when Hochul does take over, political analyst Mike Dewidziak says her style could differ from Cuomo's. For instance, she might be more willing to work with lawmakers to develop COVID safety policies. Even if she might want to take a little more, more conservative approach, she's still going to have to compromise. So we heard from her for the first time today. Kevin, when can we expect to hear more from the lieutenant governor about her specific plans to fight this pandemic? Well, Macy, she said she'd share that information in a couple of weeks, so that could mean she'll do it when she's sworn in. Hochul did acknowledge today that Governor Cuomo will still be in charge for the next 13 days.